All right, so now it is time to check out the bad ending of the Black Ops Cold War campaign. In my original first playthrough, I got the good ending, quote unquote, good ending. Uh, if you guys didn't see that, go check it out. It's the last video I uploaded on the channel. And uh, this time around, we're going to start from the interrogation mission and just make pretty much the opposite decisions we made last time. We're going to see what ends up happening. Before we get into this episode, though, make sure you guys drop a like on it, subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. Uh, and yeah, let's get right into it. Interrogation. This will overwrite your current mission's progress. Are you sure you want to continue? Yes, I do. Regular. You already know the deal. Let's get it. One hour later. Well... That was a goddamn fiasco. You go in with the intel you have, not the intel you want. We paid the fucking piper down there. You think this is Bell's fault? I don't know whose fault it is. I just know that Perseus doesn't have a single fucking nuke. He's got dozens. Millions of people are gonna die, and the United States will take the blame. You need to find out where he's planning to broadcast the activation signal. How are we gonna pull that out of our ass? Bell knows where it is. Bell? This goddamn science project was a failure! Don't count Adler out yet. The man has a deep bag of tricks. We about to lead them to the wrong direction, and this is gonna be great. The KGB will end up being the winners. All these nukes gonna go off. I mean, you know, that's still kinda harsh. The whole Europe is about to get nuked, but let's get it. Just for, you know, decision-based purposes. Come on, a little further. Look at this man acting like he's trying to help me. Only just to use me. At the end of the day. I got something for you, Adler. You're going to be pissed off at me. I'm seeing the stars right now. We're not Sims. even in the Wraith. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, get that. Because I'm about to mislead you immediately. I'm waiting. Come on. Do all this fancy stuff. Start questioning me, please. Bell. I feel like I owe you. Ah. Bloody hell. I'm going to lose a lot more than Lazar if we don't execute this next move correctly. We need you to hang in there for one more assignment. I'm counting on you again, Bell. Sims, get the dosages ready. All of them. Adler, stop wasting our valuable time. He's of no use to us anymore. If only you knew. Stay alert, Bell. You're the key to stopping persons. You always have been. No more half-assing it. We're doing an intracerebral injection. Injecting directly into the brain could provoke seizures, or worse. That man said, I bet. Let's go straight for the eye. <laughs> you sure about this, Doc? I couldn't even do that. That was just like, imagine giving somebody a shot to the eye. The memory should begin almost immediately. Bell, listen to me. I need you to remember. Think back to our time in Vietnam one more time. We need to finish what we started. We had a job to do. Alright, yeah. That's your favorite line. We had a job to do. I'm about to show you what job we had. <laughs> You're gonna be pissed off at me. Yes, sir. Think, Bell. Perseus. Do you remember coming face to face with Perseus in Vietnam? EKG is spiking. Shit. Heart rate's off the charts. I need you to relax and focus, Bell. Your helicopter crashed. You made your way through the jungle, alone. You found a bunker. Do you remember the bunker, Bell? We need to know what's inside that bunker. I got you, bro. It's very simple, you know? I'll let you know everything that's inside that bunker, 100%. percent going to see how this, this one ends. Hopefully, you know, I can get my uh, revenge. Do not trust Adler. Adler is lying to you. Do not trust him. Do not listen to Adler. He is lying to you. He is lying to you. Trust Adler. I should have listened to Perseus, man. During a mission to investigate reports of a Soviet bunker, your chopper was hit by ground fire. RPG! 
Are right, we going to try and speed through run? Speed through run? Am I okay? You woke up in the middle of a firefight. All right. Move you out the way, good buddy. <laughs> That's messed up. The crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. Oh, they got VC. We playing 2K? I still can't believe. Ooh, you know the my legs will be hurting. Ooh. Okay. Well, that's an MP5, so let me get that. Okay. Yeah, this is definitely an MP5. I don't know why he says M16. Alright, so let's get these guys up out the way, you know. Get this battle scene, this first battle scene done. We're going to revisit it, like, what, two or three more times? Oh, here, no, here, here's M16. I'm not going to use that. I'm using literally the opposite of anything he tells me to do. Oh, my God, bro. I do remember me picking up the M, that's not the M16, but the MP5 the first time, and me struggling on this part because everybody's so far away. I wonder if the nerfs apply to campaign. I don't think they do. Because they recently just uh, did their first, you know, weapon nerf in Black Ops Cold War, where they nerfed this MP5. I don't know, let me know in the comment section. I don't think it does, because I feel like the campaign is, you know, is set in stone. But at the same time, the MP5 is still a part of the game in general right let's do a little bit more exploring this time around is there anything over here it was then you realized you were the sole survivor you set off to locate the bunker it's funny how all my uh teammates just disappear out of nowhere i just don't understand that part man but let's go ahead and move it this way because there is no other way to go for now all right it's saving we moving up. We making progress. What you want me to do? The path split near a ruin, so you took the right fork, not the trail to the left. What if you go in here? Okay, nothing crazy happens if you go in there. All right, let's go left. Sorry, Adler. Oh, there's enemies up here. I'll kick you. Hey, look at that! I didn't even alert nobody. <laughs> oh, I ran out of ammo. Ooh, that's awkward. Let me get your butt in. Let me get your butt in. What am I? Am I okay? There's people all the way up there too. At least they had AK-47s. Because I ran out of ammo. Ooh, and I had a sniper? We're about to be quick scoping. The zip line nearby was the best way to get to wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. Yeah, okay. I'm gonna go across this bridge. You're gonna be pissed off at me today. I promise. Bell. Turn back and use the zip line to reach the bunker. I'm going this way. Can I go? I can go this way? What the hell? Why is Bell on scenario 11? Scenario 11? What's scenario 11? What's all the way up here? A few allies were pinned down on a ridge. You readied your sniper rifle to assist. Okay. Is this technically helping him? I've never been up here before. I went the other way before on the right. Dude, they got another sniper down there. Hey, okay, get that napalm strike. Hurry up. Alright, we gotta hold them off for 30 seconds. Or stay alive for 30. I got you, buddy. Yeah, but like I was saying, I never went up here before. Oh, shoot. Alright, let me drop this napalm strike off. They're going a little bit too crazy. I ain't gonna lie. Oh, these people are just... He's just spraying up here, bro. Oh my god. It's so hard to go prone up here, too. Inside the house hit by Napalm, you would find a hidden bunker door. Uh okay. Go check it out, Bell. I can't go back. Oh, magically the path that I used to come up here is blocked off, so I guess I have to go this way. Damn. Is this, you know, technically still following uh, what he wants me to do? I guess I have to eventually go through the bunker door anyway, because I guess the final decision really isn't made until I'm in that chair and, you know, I wake up from this, uh, you know, thing. Experience all four paths. Oh, okay, cool. Christ, what's happening to him? A mild seizure. Sims, can you hand me the benzodiazepine? Alright, whatever that means. 
The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. We've got a job to do. Let's up the dosage and run 1B this time. 1B? Okay, ready. This man run a trial runs like I'm a, I don't know, a science project. According to your debrief, you woke up and the rest of your crew was missing. The VC were on the ground searching for survivors. You readied your bow to take them out silently. Oh, uh, cross map. Okay, I finally got that man. Last time, that man, for some reason, I could not hit him. And it was making me angry, but... We got our bow and arrow skills on point. He didn't hear nothing. <laughs> Beautiful. Did he hear that? Just keep dropping these people off. Make sure I can get any and everybody before, you know, I mess up. Then there will only be probably like one or two people I gotta worry about. Oh, I alerted him. Oh, come on, you didn't see that. Ooh, caught him. Do they know where I'm at? They're running back, they're nervous. Okay, I think they might know where I'm at. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Alright, it's only, uh... Is that only him? We good? We did good, okay. Bow and arrow skills. Amazing. Let's move to this next section. What can I do that's the opposite of what you tell me this time? The forest is burning. I'm a little nervous. Oh yeah, this is where they was like having the TVs and stuff. Creepy. Cameras. Hmm. Where you want me to go now? The path split near a ruin. So you took the right fork, not the trail to the left. There has to be something that you can do with that uh, TV. I'm gonna go to the left. Oh shoot, maybe I shouldn't. These dudes sni camping in trees sniping. I feel like there was a mission in Call of Duty, like... Was it World at War campaign? Where there was like... Cam oh damn. There was like people camping in trees sniping. For some reason I just remember that in some sort of campaign. Let me know in the comment section if you remember what I'm talking about. I'm pretty sure it's World at War. The zip line nearby was the best way back to the game. We wanted to get to that bunker as soon as possible. What the hell? Lazar is right here. This man is dead, but I'm seeing him. What the Hey nah, they on sell. Turn back and use the zip line to reach the bunker. I don't want to. Alright, let's go this way this time. Actually, we can't even go to the left way. That's blocked off. Let's go down here. Lazar Seeing a firefight, you readied your M16. Well, I'm gonna use the opposite of that. Sorry, buddy. Alright, okay, we're gonna have to definitely switch these weapons out. We already know what happens at this part. We get a little chopper, but I'm um, gonna definitely need something better than this uh, pistol. Loki kind of slapped, though. I ain't gonna lie. Give me this AK-47, good buddy. And we are about to let this thing go. AK-47 is amazing in this game. I don't know how many times I'm gonna say it, but it might end up being one of my favorite assault rifles. I haven't used all of them yet. Like, fully maxed out, leveled up. But I can already tell the AK-47 is up there for sure. It's just so amazing. They did it good. Unlike the Modern Warfare version of it. Modern Warfare version was just, you know, too much recoil. It just didn't feel right. But this one, amazing. I love it. Alright, let's get all these enemies out here. Let's get this chopper inbound. And we should be good to go. Yeah, we're using literally the opposite of what he told me. Is this an Easter egg? Peter didn't like that. Okay, I mean, nothing really happened. Like, no sound was made. That would be cool if it made the Modern Warfare 2 uh, chicken noise. From when you uh, back out of the Prestige or Modern Warfare 3. It's both, actually. I think they had the same noise. That would be a nice little Easter egg, but nothing really happened right there. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, but like I was saying, we're literally using the opposite of the M16. We're using a uh, KGB weapon, technically. The Russia weapon. Or Soviet Union, whatever you want to call it. AK-47 instead of the uh, M16. Alright, come on. There you go, yep. Do, do that work, do that work. You got it. Oh, they got snipers, hang on. Take that dude out first. This chopper is loud, bro. There's a lot of loud shrieks in this game. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even notice that last time. Alright, what happens over here again when you go up this way? What's in here? Anything? Nope. Let's keep going. Oh, here's the door. 
Okay, yeah, I remember this. Oh, yo. Yes, oh. this was the bunker entrance you described in the report. Are you sure? You seem like uh, you know a lot for um, something that I'm doing the opposite of. Happy Death Day. A lab? That doesn't sound right. Bell's in the lab? What the hell? Okay, that's where I was at in 1A, I guess, or whatever he just... Because we're in 1B right now. Trial run. I didn't even see. I, I'm figuring out stuff I didn't see before. What's this? Yeah, I ran past all of this. I guess I was impatient before. What's that on the TV? Invasion Afghanistan. Is that what that says? Oh, there's another TV. And they got a flat screen too? What in the world? How we get in there? So many Easter eggs in this level that I didn't catch before. A little secrets. Oh, shoot. Why, why I got a bag over my head? This isn't working. Administering one Is that... Of oh, shoot. Hey, hell no. Oh, because I, I found that little, uh... That little thing. That was me with the bag over my head, wasn't That's it? That's it, Bell. That's what you were looking for. Perseus was in there. Yeah, maybe I skipped over all this in my first playthrough. Or maybe it's just because I went through this side. Instead of, you know, what I did before. Alright, so Percy is right there, but he's has his back faced the other way. Can't interact with the doors, can only interact with these. Okay. I got a whole bunch of pictures of Perseus. Uh, you know, the younger version. They all just over top of my body. <laughs> this is weird. I'm glad I played this again. I would have never what the hell? Um how the hell did that just happen? Yeah, this is definitely different, I'm not gonna lie. Do I... Can I go through the door? No, I guess I have to sit in the chair. Anything back there? Alright, well, sit in the chair then, I guess. Normal forms of interrogation won't work. You'll have to establish trust by building up a shared history with the subject. We have a job to do. We have a job to do. Another dose. We'll keep rerunning scenario one. Bell, we've got a job to do. I wouldn't advise that. I didn't ask. Ooh. According to your debrief, you woke up in the middle of a fire. Crash survivors were defending against a VC attack. Ready to grenade launcher and charge the head. Oh shoot, okay, damn. Let me use the uh I forgot to use the opposite of what he said. I kinda just, you know, was trigger happy. Was that Adler? Wait, are these Adlers? Yeah, these are Adlers. <laughs> what the heck? That's cool. Was this like this last time? I don't think it was. Yeah, I just realized the enemies we find are Adler. Let me see if I can get a close look at a dead. Can I, I'm dead. I can't go, I can't go prone. I'm dead. Weave, weave. Just keep weaving so I can regen. Okay. I guess the crouch is good enough. Or semi good because I keep getting hit. Can my teammates do something, man? We need some help. I'll be always, you know, shooting this M16 like, you know. I'm in burst mode, but. It's the M16A1 and I need to be in auto, alright? So just hold down the trigger and I'm good. Marker, come on. Yeah, let's go ahead and take a look at these Adler bodies. I think there might be one more enemy over there. Look at this, man. R.I.P. to my man Adler times 40. <laughs> Is that it? I swear there was one more dude back there I didn't get to kill. Maybe he magically... Hang on, let me get the opposite. Opposite weapon. Wow, this is cool. I like how they made multiple endings, I'm not gonna lie. This is definitely way different than before. Okay, what do you want me to do now? The path split near a ruin. So he took the right fork, not the trail to the left. Right, so I'm gonna go to the left again. This is three times to the left. Stop fighting me, Bell, and go right. No. Go back and take the right path to the bunker. What are you gonna do about it if I don't, huh? Nothing. We ain't gonna do nothing to me, man. I'm the key to what you need. So you're gonna like what I'm doing. And there's nothing you can do about it. Oh, what the hell? Everything's like in slow-mo right now. 
or the sound is at least. Bell, take the zip line down to the river. I think not. I think I can just walk past. This is everything in freeze frame. Bell, go back to the zip line. The bunker is in the caves. Go. Oh, I think it forces you to. You can't come this way. You can't go this way. That way is blocked off. I guess you have to individually go to different ways. If you don't follow him in the first one, I guess. Well, I guess we got to take the zip line. Because that, yeah, that's the only other way to go. Alright, so we skipped that scenario completely. We went through the zombie hole in the uh, first playthrough. Is there anything else back here? I never really got a good look no, at that man. statue. You found the bunker by going into the cave. I understand. Alright, well, I guess we have to go into the cave to get to the next scenario unless I miss something. Whatever. Okay. The sound is really throwing me off, I'm not gonna lie. At least I made him pissed by going the wrong way first. You equipped your shotgun and had a bow with me. That's when you discovered BC soldiers meeting with Soviet agents. I didn't even know I could go to the right before. Well, is there a way I can switch out? I mean, it's not even that serious. I can just use this bow, honestly. Come on, man. This is actually... Wait, whoa, where did he come from? This is actually a pretty overpowered piece of cover. They trying to... Why are they running? There's only one dude and they running away from me. And what was he... Who was he, who was he aiming at? What's over here? Can I go this way? Nope. It looks like you can go that way, but the game blocks you off. Alright, so we go down there, but what's over here? Anything? Can I squeeze through this? Nope. <laughs> so many different, like, you know, things they designed. I just wanted to check out. Really appreciate this level instead of rushing through it like last time. Alright, what's next up? I forgot. Am I going the wrong way? No, I gotta be going the right way, right? What is this? Yeah, I don't know why I wouldn't let me uh go there before. Maybe I didn't jump right. Oh, what the hell? How you doing, buddy? I'm here with my bow and arrow. Oh, they, they, what's it called? Descending in? How you guys doing? You guys doing good? Repelling in, huh? You guys about to, you know, experience a very bad time. Even though this is all, all, uh, a false reality. What's over here? Oh, it's just light. I thought, for some reason, it looked like a statue. For, this looks like an uncharted cave. Like a, a, a cave you would see in Uncharted in, like, the story. I forgot what part of the story. I think it might have been Uncharted. Three or four, maybe? I don't know. It looks spooky, though. I'm not gonna lie. Yes, Bell. That was the door into the Soviet bunker. How I get to that ladder? I, I never realized that ladder before. <laughs> trying to, can I super jump? Nope. <laughs> I need, I need a, uh... I need a boost. I don't care if the door was fucking stuck. Open it. Too bad that, you know, I need to drink some water because my mouth is getting dry. Pause. Taking my sweet time. He's getting angry, so let's go slower. Let's see if we can, you know, we got a map right here. Okay, cool. Anything else? We got some stuff playing right here. Got some uh, tapes. All right, cool, cool, cool. Make sure we don't miss anything on this go through can't go through these doors or anything okay we just start going through this door Park, give Bell another injection that could be lethal Bell's heart rate is do it high. now okay is this where the hallway gets like heart rate is spiking I'm not sure how much longer Bell can last pause <laughs> I just realized that is this where you know the hallway it's super uh, short and I get really tall or something like that. My heart rate is, you know. Oh, shoot. Am I really about to die? I don't remember this happening like this. Good. Everything's stabilizing. Okay, hang on. I ain't get to play this last time. Drop bombs. What they mean? Oh, yeah, this is what we about to do. That's funny. <laughs> That's funny this is the game that they put right here because this is exactly what I'm about to do. About to let these bombs go kaboom. Let's get it, man. Alright, this is where the doors start shutting. 
with some scary movie type stuff. The hell? They shooting at me, man. Don't shoot at me. How you doing, bro? You doing good? Adler, don't close the door on me. Oh, I feel it. Uh, is it like foreshadowing that he was about to shoot me? Because he was at the door and then, you know, shots came through the door. I just realized that. So that's, you know, in the good ending. Quote, unquote. Bell, stop speaking. Oh, yeah, this is where I get super tall. Or the, some trippy Bell. stuff. They start giving me too many drugs. Alright, we making our way to the end. Anything uh, that I'm missing in this uh, part? I don't think so. What the hell? Okay, I can go back that way. What happens if you go back this way? I don't, or is it just like one? Stop wasting my time with this hallway. Okay, so is this just? Turn around. Bill. I ain't gonna lie, there was definitely three clocks on that wall. Oh yeah, this is on some trippy stuff. I ain't gonna lie. What the lab? What the hell is Bell doing in the lab? I'm cooking up, bro. Okay, can't do anything with those. I'm about to make some beats. Alright. Bell, forget about the damn lab. I need to know about the bunker. I mean, you're not giving me a choice, man. So let's go. Oh my god. Okay, here we go. I think this is where the, you know, the loop stops. Perseus, how you doing, my guy? I'm about to help you out in a minute. Comrades. The United States and its allies slowly consume. Mm-hmm. My man Perseus, how you doing, bro? See if I miss anything in this. Oh, yeah, there's hella stuff. I'm not going to be able to catch all this. There's probably like 30 million Easter. Okay, I thought I could press it. It was like a red button. Anything else I can do in this room besides go on the computer at the back? Doesn't seem like it. Can't use the door. Couldn't interact with Perseus. Let's use this. Alright, so last time I uh, typed in Perseus on this computer. Let's see what happens when I do something else. Or is it all the same result? Operation Greenlight Nova 6. Nova 6. Let's try that out. Can't read any of that. Nova 6. Yeah, I don't think it matters what you do right here. It's pretty much the same, you know, gibberish. Don't trust Adler. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. Been through the hell of Vietnam together. We've got a job to do. We got a job to do. Can Bell survive another round? Now you're asking me. Do it. We're not leaving empty. Oh yeah, this is where fast forward is. Never mind. Ready. Bell, we've got a job to do. Yeah. Okay. So we are gonna fast forward through the first part, and I think what happens after this. I think we make it back to the same room. Yep, fast forward me. Skip ahead to the next one. The bunker door was right there at the ruins, Bell. You went in. Right? Now what if I don't go in? Can I go either way? Bell, go into the bunker now. <laughs> this man about to be pissed off at me. Bell, open the door. <laughs> oh yeah, this man getting pissed. Tell me about Perseus. Oh yeah, this man about to he about to kill me. What happened in the bunker, Bell? What the hell? Oh yeah, he about to get real pissed off. Bell, Perseus said something to you. What was it? I'm not going through it, man. I'm weaving. Damn, oh it forced Bell, you. The door. Go inside. <laughs> he literally traps you in a room. Oh, I guess we have no option. <laughs> That's funny, bro. You just start getting doors flying from the sky. All right, so we got to sit down. Anything else we can do in this part? Uh, nope. Everything looks about the same to me. Now, what about the other dialogue choices? Uh, when we're sitting in the actual chair, when we're off the drugs. Three TVs, we got a clock. You're the only one who knows where Perseus is. 
where he'll detonate the nukes. Where is he, Bell? Comrades, the United States and its allies slowly consume that which is dear to us. Our leaders continue to weaken under this threat. It is the moral duty of Perseus to act when they will not. Soon we will possess an American nuclear bomb. The key to unlocking their entire green light arsenal. Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. We gonna be safe with my man Perseus. Right, okay, so this is what happens. How you doing, Adler? You gotta admit, I'm surprised. I didn't think they'd recover so fast. We tried everything. Normal forms of interrogation weren't working. Breaking a subject's will and erasing their mind is a difficult and painful process. That's a small price to pay. The CIA's mind control program has had a great deal of success with implanted memories. You want me to tell them about my time in Vietnam? Lastly, you'll need a command phrase to trigger the implanted memories. We have a job to do. 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 You had to reach the Soviet bunker. It appears the subject's programming is beginning to take hold. We've got a job to do. We've known each other for years. Fought together, bled together, been through the hell of Vietnam together. We got a job to do. And now the training's complete. You just need to give the subject a name. Mason. Bell. Or that too. Yeah, but Mason and Bell have a lot of similarities. And it's funny, we're on the same team. Okay, back to reality. He's coming too. Bell, no more fucking around. What did Perseus say? Where is he? Mm-hmm. Yep, grab. Who am I? What's happening to me? You're disoriented, Bell. We'll explain everything later. Right now, we need to help each other. We gave you a second chance when you were shit out of luck. Now, we just want some assistance in return. Bell, you were one of Perseus's agents. His associate, Arash Kardavar, turned on you at the airstrip in Turkey. Left you for dead. Okay, I remember this part. I got it, bro. I understand. When the plane leaves trap zone, he's stopping in Juba. This you know. Here's what you don't know. Perseus won't be there. None of these hired guns are going to leave Duba alive. We'll dump their bodies in the forest. Then we will move the weapons to Volkov in Berlin. Can I shoot him before he shoots me? From there, we fly to Solovetsky. How about if I weave? Let me weave. But I have other plans for you. Perseus thinks too highly of you. I don't want the competition. Weave? Are oh, you going to up that thing any faster, my, my boy? I'm going to take 30 minutes to up a pistol. Yeah, but we don't switch sides though, that's the thing. We're gonna stay loyal to the KGB. The CIA reinvented you, Bell. We needed to give you a new identity to replace the old. It was Park's idea to make you MI6. She wanted that bond with you. He even picked up a bit of her accent. And we were able to utilize your language and cryptography skills as an added bonus. The bigger challenge was your memory. The CIA's MK Ultra program used Atlas missions in Vietnam as a template. We needed you to have that shared experience, that lifelong bond, to establish trust. I don't trust you guys, so, you know, now what? People are sick. I was never really in Vietnam. How did changing my identity help you? Are your hands clean, Bell? 
Yeah, I was never really in Vietnam. No, count yourself lucky. You've only had those memories for a few months. Me, I've been living with them for over a decade. All right. Well, you're not gonna be living them with living with them for much longer. Let's go. Interrogation didn't work with you, but thanks to MK Ultra's research, we had a backup plan. If you believed you were someone else, we could lead you to a place where you'd give everything up. I don't think so. You're still holding back on us, and we are going to get it out of you. <laughs> we have a job to do. Ah, uh, shoot. Maybe I shouldn't have said that. Oh, I shouldn't have said that. Damn. Oh, uh, he had he put the trigger word on me. Kept you in line, but it didn't get us everything we needed. Your innermost secrets were always locked behind a door. Yeah, I was mysterious. Bell, I realize you probably hate us right now. What we've done to you. I just need you to fully understand the stakes here. What you do right now is not about me, it's not about you, it's about millions of other fucking people. It's about stopping someone who in the end has no true allegiance to anyone other than himself. So tell me, where is Perseus? Once we control the green light arsenal, we will detonate them all from the safety of Solovetsky. This is your chance to define who you really are, Bill. Where is Perseus? From the safety of Solovetsky. Yep. He's in. Yeah, okay. Mm hmm. He's over there, man. Yep. Duga. Sims, get Washington on the line. Everyone else, gear up. We're leaving now. You made the right choice, Bell. Come on. You're still one of us. Uh-huh. Yep. Oh, he got they got his name highlighted in red. Set up ambush at Duga. Oh shoot. Oh, we finally get to go back here? Oh shoot. Tell Percy I'm bringing Russell Adler's team to Duga now. That's lit. We'll leave within the hour. I wonder what happens if you don't, you know, do it before the time to exfil. Oh, shoot. Five years ago, NATO intelligence detected a powerful signal of unknown origin. The new signal created radio disruptions worldwide. Not to mention all kinds of conspiracy theories. NATO quickly tracked it to this facility in the Soviet Republic of Ukraine. The Duga Radar Array. It's an over-the-horizon radar system. Big improvement over their old missile defense tech. It uses a lot of juice. Could be used to broadcast any kind of long-range signal they want. Like detonation codes to every green light nuke in Europe. Where exactly is this thing? About 60 miles north of Kiev. Between the cities of Pripyat and Chernobyl. It's nothing but thick forest for miles around. A perfect hiding spot for Perseus. We'll have to drop you in a little further out. No recon, no heavy support. Just a light infiltration squad. Shouldn't be a problem. Just point the way. Bell came through for us in the nick of time. I never doubted it. <laughs> Testing subject. Well, your test has been failed, man. And you coming in light. You guys not even ready for this. Adler, still seeing no activity from our side. Same. I haven't seen shit. All right. Everyone converge on the gate. Wow, look at this place. Got the flags. Yeah, we in their home base, man. Behind enemy lines. Got the green pickup. You sure you're not forgetting something, Bill? Nah. Ashes to ashes. There's nothing here. This can't be the right place. We ain't seeing anything on our side either. It's him. He fucking lied to us. That true, Bell? You pull us out to the middle of nowhere Russia so Perseus can detonate those nukes? Signal ambush, you underestimate me. Goodbye, Adler. Oh shoot, here we go. Oh, that man did a signal. RPG! Oh wait, what? What you doing? Oh. 
Um, that didn't kill me. <laughs> he was trying to take out two birds with one. Eliminate your former team. Oh, that's messed up. They can't do it. Why do I have to do it? Y'all shooting just like me. I'm gonna let y'all boys handle that. I feel it. 100 woods. I got it. Damn, we gonna have to kill the OG characters. That's messed up. I'm okay with killing Adler, you know. Park, you know. Uh, Adler's the main person I want to, you know, absolutely destroy. They really not gonna kill him for me? I guess you really have to just kill him. Yeah, I mean, I'm cool with Park still, even though, you know, she was a part of this, but... Adler, he's the one that ends up killing me at the end. Oh shoot. What you gonna do about that? I mean, Woods, you cool too, but, you know, you didn't even really like me. You still don't even really like me anyway, so... God damn it, Bell. You're gonna die here. Well, I guess they not gonna... Alright, Park, sorry. Oh! They got a slow-mo for... Oh, that's messed up. Hey, nah, they... And I might have to do that for Woods and Mason. Oh yeah, that's messed up. Oh, come on, Woods. Now nah, let's shoot him in the uh the woo woo. I definitely did not aim there, but okay. They just wanted to be as brutal as possible. <sighs> Sorry, my uh complete opposite Mason. Damn, bro. Yeah, bro. Mason and Bell like super super similar, but on different sides. Or now they're on different sides. Over here, comrade. This is it. This is it, man. Your friend went through here. He is not far. Come out and play. You are running out of time. And space. Let's follow my man's. It's my original squad. And they programmed me to believe I was on their squad. Becomes the mouse. Oh, this man already bleeding. Oh, yeah, we just gotta finish him. Uh huh. Time. To oh, yeah. Ooh, it's time for you to die, good buddy. Glad to see you still care. Mind giving me a light? This man is still trying to. I'd offer you a cigarette, but you don't smoke anymore. We tried to help you with all your worst qualities. <coughs> I guess science still has its limits. Please, just shut him up. <laughs> Looks like you made a new friend. <coughs> I'm happy for you. He seems charming. He's really growing on me. <coughs> well, the whole purpose is to do the opposite. I'm not about to pick that up so you can, you know, pull out your... Whoa, whoa, you got a blick on you? Oh, yeah, I don't know what's on that side. Check this out. Get bored easily, kid. You're really getting good at this. Okay, how long do you keep talking? Okay. The ladder's literally right there. You could reach it for yourself. Can I just let him bleed out? You good? I know, I know you can wait for him to bleed out. The man just not even moving, he's just chilling. I mean, he's doing different things. So maybe you can let him bleed out. I'm gonna shoot him in his toe. Oh, that's my man. Oh, what's good, Perseus? My guy. Yes, sir. Solovetsky, stand by for the detonation order. I think you deserve this moment, comrade. Oh, we about to uh, set off the nukes. Let the nuke. Let the new Soviet era begin. Detonate the nukes. The West falls today. Detonate the nukes. Yeah, we taking over. Let's get it. 
Can't even say nothing. I wish we could return to Solovetsky to watch it all unfold. But that chapter is closed now. We begin the next one together. You did well. And to think, after all this time, they still believe I'm Perseus. Who are you? As if Perseus could ever be an individual working alone. Oh, it's like a group? So American. Oh yeah, I was way off track then. Ah. We'll need a new home now. The Central Committee will be more surprised than the CIA. Even if we made the best choice for the future of our homeland. Hmm, yet. For humanity. Their eyes will be as clouded as ours once were. Come. There is still much to be done. See, there's so much loyalty with this side, bro. The other side, they fake. My God. How many green light nukes did he detonate? All of them, Mr. President. Does anyone know the bombs were ours? Materials related to Operation Greenlight were anonymously released an hour ago, presumably by Perseus. Calls are beginning to come in from across the globe. That son of a bitch. You and Vice President Bush are to be moved to secure locations immediately. I want any business related to this thing erased forever. Everything. Can you make that happen? Of course. It's already begun. Wow. They're blocking the media? Is that what they're doing? <laughs> wow. What's this? Oh, this is the... Uh... We will watch Europe burn. We will watch the Empire of the United States collapse under its own weight. They're literally burning the evidence, wow. A world with two superpowers will become a world with one. The Soviet Union. And if the leaders of this new world order squander the opportunity we have provided them, then they too will be replaced. Kasim Javali. He fell into the hands of your former CIA friends. Kasim is too soft. I will need you to personally supervise his erasure. Ah, oh, so these are the people I captured. We gotta, uh... <laughs> That's funny. Damn, I wonder if you do this whole story, like, reverse then. What happens? As with Kasim... The CIA is now holding Anton Volkov. If you can locate him, bring him back to us. If they have broken him, he must be eliminated. I feel like there would be like more like DLC to the story. Or like there's got to be a part two or something because on both ways it kind of ends in a cliffhanger. You say that Eliezer Azoulay perished in Cuba. We will not miss that one. His interference with our Middle East assets will be a distraction no more. As for the rest, it was a pleasure eliminating them by your side. With the West in chaos, our key agents within the United States are in place and ready for the next phase of our plan. And is there any secret cutscene after this? Is what we doing with Perseus? Now that Europe is in disarray, our agents within their respective governments can help craft Europe's future. One completely aligned with the interests of the Soviet Union. My friend, we are just getting started. Yeah, there's gotta be a DLC where you just strictly play on their side. Something, come on, Treyarch, don't do that. Don't leave it just like that. Okay, so that's the end. There's no like secret cutscene where Perseus does something, you know, snaky. This is just straight loyalty. Honestly, this ending is like... I mean, realistically, it's better because, you know, we were already on the enemy side at first. We just got brainwashed. Or we didn't remember. And, you know, we got reprogrammed to believe we were with the CIA. 
So realistically, this is how, you know, things should have went. You know? I don't know. This ending is uh definitely way better than the good, quote-unquote good ending, because we did all that to help them just for me to get killed by Adler. I don't know. I mean, it kind of sucks that I had to, you know, kill out Woods and Mason. Park, you know, eh. You know, at Lazar, I really didn't care about him. But Adler, ooh, I'm so glad. I should have did something even more brutal than just shoot him in the foot, but I was just trying to be funny or whatever. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this uh, alternate ending or bad ending, which some people call it. I don't think it's a bad ending in my opinion. Uh, if anything, this is the good ending. So let me know what you guys think. Drop a like on today's video if you guys did enjoy it. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. We just hit 400 subscribers on the second channel. So I appreciate you guys so much. Let's keep going crazy. Uh, hopefully I can provide you guys with some PS5 games. Um, I ordered a new one, so we'll see uh, We'll see how things go with that. I don't know when I'm going to end up getting it, but you'll see on the channel when I end up getting it. We're going to go crazy. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace.